hello guys how are you all i hope all are good so guys today we'll see one error in postman okay so i got comments regarding this actually i have done video but uh okay that is the one of the reason where you you will get that error that is uh, it is like could not send request or it might be a, a connect E connection refused the error okay so you will get like this guys for example suppose if you are testing an API you can see guys I am testing this API okay which is an customer create API I have created here but while creating I am getting this error okay suppose if you are facing the same error then what you need to do uh, and one more thing I'll tell you I have created this API using Laravel okay so if you are created in node.js also no problem guys uh, you need to uh, follow the same process okay whatever I am telling Right. so what you have to do is uh, just first you check whether your ZAMP is started or not that is local server okay so I'll check first that so you can see here is my local server that is ZAMP so it is not started okay so what I'll do I will start and I'll check okay so you just first check this whether it is started or not just make it start so mm. I'm making it start guys you can see I don't know why they're showing this okay you can see guys it is started i have started the apache and mysql server okay now i'll check whether it will work or not see now also i'm getting the same error if i go in console there also i'm getting uh, this error only okay that is three error i'm getting fine so i'll remove it okay so this is one one reason is guys you need to start your server okay if it is not started you need to start the next is i'll go in code and i'll check whether it is there it started or not okay so you can see guys this is my code where i have created my api okay so here is my api fine so to uh, here also you can see i have created but i have not started guys it is not started means my local server is not here it is started but in my code uh, the my program is not running okay so i have to make it run first okay so i'll check this also that is php artisan so so i have started here my server you can see guys my server is running on this port now okay this port because i am using here if you go here you can you can see guys here my uh, port is there okay so i have not started here so it was not working here okay because i am using this port only here so it must should start okay so suppose if you are doing in uh, other language also like node and all you need to start to us uh, that is code and all and then whatever the ip address by getting uh, that you need to use here okay then what do you do guys just after you can see the ip address is same so is nothing but it is working on this server i can say and i'll go here i'll test the my api whether it is working or not okay now you can see guys uh, i got my answer but i'm getting the finder inter server error why because the email id is already taken so already it is there so i'm getting that error so i'll change this to one two three and i'll check okay you can see guys here my uh, my customer has created successfully okay so earlier whatever error i was getting that is a validation error guys because already i have added this uh, already one email id was there suppose if you added one more email it will not take because i have given one condition email id should be unique okay so i got that error so i hope guys you got what will be the reason if you are getting that error so you just follow this process and you will get the answer okay suppose if you have any question regarding this thing guys you can comment in comment box and if you are liking my videos then like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much guys keep supporting me